And then I say, Miria, do I look like a guest? Miria, light your way. Stand aside. Then someone else will have to. What do you want? I'm beset by petitioners these days. Another advocate for this absurd plan to retake Melsen Shear, I take it. Look to Rathia's sister across the strait. Her battered walls, her burned gardens, her back broken from a decade of war. We take in refugees. We send them food that we can spare. We try to ease her pain. But for ten years I stood here and watched her die slowly. And now you, a stranger, think to convince me to commit the whole of this city to saving her because our army's greatest failure has recovered some old relic. Mel Senshir stands as Rathia's eastern shield. Even now nearly broken, she still stands. This city can do nothing for the fortress, but perhaps its people can. The wounded we have here wish to return to fight for the fortress one last time. I'll tell them to meet you at the docks, and take this as well from my own collection. May it be of use to you in the coming battle. Go to the eastern docks in the lower city and find Captain Dodwin. He will oversee your journey to Melson Shear. Go. Save our sister across the sea or Citizen. die. Citizen. Curios, talismans, items of power. Thirty, not a gold piece. Stand aside. Just listen to the two of them. Husband and wife? Welcome to Rathia, outsider. weapons but if it's the armor you need you'll have to speak to that husband of mine come see me again Sif Sif Seder at your service. Don't mind the racket. Just my wife at Harpy across. Good.
anything that can't be found here. Give us a wink, love. Drives. My rusty nail of a husband man. Come see me again. Got anything in need of mending? I can do it. Lyria, light your way. Rathia sails with you this day. Godspeed. What is the ships are loading now for Melsen Shear. Are you ready to board? Right away. Agarth, you know better than any of us how this will end. Why must we fight a war that you know we will not win? You would still ask that to Lara. After all you've seen. Until I get an answer, Fate Weaver. Until then. Why do we fight? Because there is hope. Because only through battle can we break the chains that Fate has forged. Don't you see? We have been given a chance, and though some of us will die, we will die knowing that our lives were finally our own, that we are no longer slaves to the whims of fate. Would you throw it away? Just for fear of another defeat? Not I. I will fight. And if I die, I die knowing that I have made a choice. And this choice, for good or for ill, was my own. Yourself. Not exactly the heroes of legend, but you're a welcome sight nonetheless. Likely, you've come to see the fortress before it falls. I've seen her stand for the last ten years, but the end, I think, has finally come. Our scouts report that the Tuatha are massing, and in their wake we've seen it. The Niskaru Lord, Baylor, has come for Melsenshir at last. Indeed, they expect us to hide behind the walls of Melsenshir. Instead, we'll rush the field and delay the Baylor's arrival. That leaves the Witch Knight. Malwin is the commander of the Tuatha forces, and likely the one who has made a pact with the Baylor. You and Talera will be part of an effort to kill him. If we can kill Witch Knight Malwin, then the Baylor may run rampant in the field, and in the chaos we can rout the Tuatha. It is much to hope for, but that's the plan. Soon. I know you're eager. But take a moment to make sure you're ready. Check your gear and say your goodbyes. When you're ready, come meet me by the gates. I'll be readying the troops.
Pray to Lyria that fate is on our side. Come on, the commander's... Better make sure your armor is repaired. Commander Oweiglan wants to talk before we leave. Witch Knight Malwyn and his forces bested me ten years ago, and I've been preparing myself since then. If I'm not ready now, then I don't deserve another chance. I hope they don't attack with the trolls. What is it? Time is running out! Steal yourselves. The battle is not to be taken lightly. Then let us go. We've had sightings of the Tuatha Vanguard. When they enter the courtyard, we will open the gates and counterattack. You and Talera will use the distraction to execute your plan. One way or another, this will be over soon. Fine day for a battle. Our hunt for Malwyn can now begin in earnest. I will take one path and you another. If a Wigeland's troops hold, then Malwyn will be delayed at the outer wall with the Baelor. But we should make sure he doesn't get past us. Now we must get moving. There is no room for error. We can't let those Tuatha reach our archers. Go! You and Talera need to find Malwyn and kill him.
again. Someone's got to make sure these ladders stay down. And you need to move before O'Wiglin's troops start falling back. Hmm. Oh, finally, some reinforcements. We tried to fight off the two Arthur, but they took most of our company prisoner. They're threatening to execute the rest unless we lay down our arms. You could get in amongst them, silently, if possible, and save what's left of the survivors.
chance before they can regain control of the creature. Oh! Theoden, guide my hand. For fear! Still alive! You've got to destroy Baylor before it tears this place apart. I know, child. Everything seemed still in that moment when she struck the Baylor. At least she died how she wanted to. But her sacrifice won't mean anything unless you do something to stop that beast. Yeah. <laughs> 
They're gone. After ten years, I can't believe they're finally gone. It's over. After all these years, the siege is broken, and we're alive. Thank the gods for sending you to us. This is a glorious day, but I have heard a bitter rumor in the wake of all of this. Is it true? Has Talera fallen? Then the rumors of her dishonor will finally be silenced. She gave everything to us in the end, and the world will know that. When we rebuild these walls, we'll name them after General Talera. Her memory will stand as long as the ramparts shine. But she never would have been here had you not delivered her to us. It can never be enough, but we hope you'll accept this as our thanks. We freed the city, but the Tuatha still hold most of Clericon. Over the years, they've infected every part of these swamps. Clearing them out isn't going to be easy, but we might have help. There are rumors of a small band of fighters harassing the Tuatha. Perhaps the hero of Mel Senshir can convince them to work with us. Good luck.
What? Our soldiers are doing their best out there, but it's still a nightmare. Watch out for those red-eyed bastards. You! Stop! State your business! Keep your hands off me, fool! I'm no Tuatha! I must speak with the Seeds Breaker! Thank <laughs> you. 